Yeah, mainly west of Interstate 35 has been seeing the rainfall this morning and even some embedded thunderstorms. The metro area is starting off mainly sunny. The sunrise is bright this morning. Looking outside, 64 right now with the dew points comfortable in the mid 50s. A southeast wind at six. So where we're seeing the rainfall right now, you can see around Harlan, Red Oak and Clorinda getting some heavier downpours. Interstate 80 going to be a little wet, especially the farther west you go. So if you're traveling to Omaha this morning, just be aware of that. Make sure you take the rain gear and some embedded thunder and uh, thunderstorms are with these as well. Nothing severe out of these, but again, they are generally pulling toward the south southeast this morning and western Iowa is going to be the main area that we're going to see these showers and thunderstorms uh, kind of hanging about here for the next couple of hours. Another batch up to the northwest. Probably going to get a break here in the next couple of hours. Midday should be dry and then we'll see the chance for more showers and a few thunderstorms developing during the afternoon. Those will be pretty spotty, not widespread. Northeast actually looking really good right now. Mid 50s for Waterloo, Grinnell at 56, mostly clear in Mason City, a little warmer and a little bit more humid down at the southwest. Look at that dew point of Mason City right now. Not bad for a late July day, 49, even uh, not bad. Their names at 54 degrees for your dew point. So showers and thunderstorms west this morning. Midday should be mainly dry and then spotty showers and storms will try to redevelop as we get into the afternoon. Now, you know, our model in particular, not really showing the intensity and the uh, most of the action off toward the west this morning, but Overall trend for today, we are going to see a few of these trying to refire later on during the daytime heating. So five o'clock again, central Iowa has a better chance to see some of these westward. I think mainly east is going to stay mostly sunny to partly cloudy and dry through today. Tonight stays mainly dry uh, overnight, and then as we get into tomorrow morning, we could see some more showers and storms redeveloping, especially west. And really, uh, the models are indicating in the next couple of days, we will see a chance for storms each day, but better chances will be west of Interstate 35 for those isolated storms today. So again, going to be dodging some rain out to the west this morning. East stays mainly sunny 80 here in the metro. Again, those isolated storm chances, not a washout for the upcoming day. So if you have plans outdoors, you know, don't cancel them. Just be aware that that will be a risk out there uh, for a few storms trying to develop. Sunday, humidity starts to return into Monday and then Tuesday, a little dip in the temperatures before uh, a shower chance returns by Wednesday. Right after